Walter, I have appreciated this conversation. I think you have too, in the sense that that we're able to talk about these things with Christian love to one another, and we can agree on on the basic things of the Word of God, and that the Word of God is the inspired Word of God, and it is our authority. And we can disagree on some of these other things. And for people in the church, okay, you got churches that hold to the old earth. If if some of the people want to look at the young earth viewpoint. And if people have a young earth church in the sense that they, the majority hold that viewpoint, but they want to investigate old earth, how can we do this in the future in a civil way, in terms of Christian way? What's the manner we should do this? How can we model it? Yeah, John, uh, our debate here is just a microcosm of uh, a watching world. They want to see what makes these Christians work and how do they treat one another? What's their mindset? How do they handle... Uh, the whole spectrum, not just uh, specialties here, but how well do they listen to each other? What spirit of humility and what things are really non-negotiable and what things are they saying, well, here's my view, but I'm listening and I'm open. I think the watching world has a right to expect that of us and therefore what we have tried to demonstrate here is that Indeed, there are some things that really join us together, as you just uh, went uh, over. But there are other areas where God is so much greater than what we are. He ha- his mind has spoken here in the Word, but we're grasping after it. And like Peter, who looked at some of Paul's writings, he said, Boy, some of these things are hard to understand. I just can't quite fathom all of that. If that's an apostle who got the Word of God... Me thinks that little Walter Kaiser ought to also fall down before the word and say, God is greater than I am, or even my interpretations or theories. That doesn't mean I have no certainties. Oh, I surely do think God made the whole thing. He started it. There was nothing before he started. He did it by his word. He was the one who took out all of the inhabited world except eight persons, and that for good theological reasons. But there are many other things beyond this that are extremely important and that ha- will play a role in this, but which I have not quite yet comprehended at all. And I suspect every one of us must have that pocket and area in which we're willing to give it over to the Lord. Last 30 seconds, Ken. Yeah. You know what we've got to be doing? Looking at not young earth versus old earth. It's what does this say? Is this or is this not the Word of God? Uh, I think 